Oh, hey guys, how's it going? So, this is some pretty awesome game you've probably never heard of before called Vatone Rebellion. And this was um, sort of a game from the 1990s. So I thought I would, um, you know, have a bit of a playthrough and see what you guys think. Now, it's not an easy game, and I'm going to put the difficulty up to max, I think. Which is that. And I'm going to increase the connections, okay? Now, there's four different playable races that you can be. And this actually supports multiplayer too. So, basically, you've got the blue dudes, who kind of look funny. I quite like them. Kind of looking like hairy monkeys or something. These dudes, which are kind of grabby dudes. Look at them grabbing stuff. Fire dudes are very, very cool. And lastly, the dialer, okay? Um, who are these green dudes, they're pretty sweet. And they're all into nature and stuff. So this is um, the game on maximum difficulty. So I thought I would jump right in and um, see see what the game's like, you know, see what it's running like in um, on Windows 10 2019, yeah. Okay, so first thing you'll notice is, um, Okay, first thing you'll notice is these little curly whirly things, okay? Um, so we're going to um, build a tone spreader, okay? These basically um, allow you to um, see further along the screen, okay? Uh, actually, is that the wisest thing to do? Okay. So the first thing I'm going to need in the game is this um, like standard tone generator, okay? So it's going to cost 35 as you can see, we've got 40 stored up. Now this pool down here is a pool of tone, okay? So this pool actually gives me um, all the tone that I need. Um, so at the moment, the flow is 12, okay? So I'm going to keep seeing my little creatures um, growing, okay? And they're um, basically absorbing the tone. Now each building absorbs one tone, okay? So... Um, what I'm going to need to do is I'm going to need to build one of these, okay? Um, so, another tone spreader, okay? So, tone spreader, I think they cost 10, or is it 15? Um, anyway, what's going to happen now is half of these dudes are going to put the tone in my storage house, okay? Which is like um, where my little woodland creatures came from, okay? And half are going to go up here, okay? So that's pretty inefficient use of our time, okay? But we want to get this delicious tone up here. Now bear in mind, I'm actually playing on hard, so there's no guarantee I'll even survive this, okay? So I think what I'm going to do, I think I'm going to put a hat on that now. So I've got 20 saved up. Ooh! Did you see some vanished? That's interesting. So now we've got a surplus for a low of 15. Um, we're going to collect objects through the game, and the objects can be used to um, interface, basically, with um, different um, buildings in the game, okay? So what I really need is I really need another one of these, okay? Obviously, it's going to take tone, but this will um, give me double the um, construction anyway. So my population is going to keep increasing until um, until it doesn't, basically. <laughs> no, until my um, surplus flow is lower. Um, okay, let's go over some buttons. Um, this button here takes me to the universe view, okay, which is nice. This. I forget what it does. Oh, it toggles the health of my creatures. What does this one do? Um, changes the screen so we can see what's active in construction. You can also change the priority of building. Okay, so by default, if you've got two things built, half of your um, creatures will go and build that, and the other half will go build the other thing. So you can... I could put this at high priority, for example. And it means that, yeah, pretty much everyone's going to basically build that. And this, I'm not going to click it, 
but this um, button here is the emergency alarm okay now we've also got this cross here okay and um, so basically at the moment I think my creatures are more well, stronger because um, the planets are um, sort of aligned to nature or something Oh Christ. So an enemy's attacking as you can see here. So I'm gonna um, put on red alert. Now these guys are pretty useless at attacking. So what we're gonna need to do, we're gonna need to Oh jeez. is really bad a lot of my little creatures are dying here so but they should regenerate anyway so what I'm gonna need to do is I'm gonna need to build like a dojo here okay now dojos actually um, allow me to create special warrior classes okay and the warrior classes are better at um, attacking things like those um, horrible creatures Ah, I've just heard a noise that um, suggests one of my pools has been infected, or one of the enemy pools has been infected with um, a sort of en enemy spawn, okay? Which is very bad. Now these guys, okay, they're kind of like the Borg in a sense, but if you don't attack them, they kind of won't attack you. Um... Yeah, this is pretty bad news, to be honest. Perhaps I should have built an a dojo more quickly. So my population's nine, okay. And um, I'm trying to obviously destroy these um, nasty beasts here. Okay, quick, let's get up that dojo, okay. Oh jeez. Okay, so the enemy has actually taken a tone pool over here. Okay. Um They've also destroyed um They've destroyed this um <clears throat> tone spreader up here, which kinda means that um this one has stopped functioning. Now, we are going to need a few more things, okay? So, for example, um, our warriors are going to need um, Crystal Tone, okay? To give them strength. And they're going to put the Crystal Tone in here. Ah, oh, really? really isn't good. Well, I've got 14 population, so I should be okay in this little fight. Yeah, 13 population. This is hard mode, bear in mind. And bear in mind, there's plenty of other planets. So, well, plenty of other rocks that I need to kind of invade and conquer. Is this dude attacking? Actually, I wanted him to do that. So I'm actually kind of pleased he did that because um, that building wasn't really doing anything because it had been cut off from the zone. Okay, brilliant. Let's get this built and then we can maybe power up and get some warriors. Okay, it's gonna sound. Oh. I need this bill. I just need this freaking bill. All right. I guess they can go and attack. At least my population's going up when the enemy kill them. But bear in mind, because the enemy's taken the tone pool here, it means that more enemies are gonna spawn. So you know, I can actually spell the end. Potentially. 
Now get that thing built. Come on, guys. Now I can kill him. Bear in mind the dojo's got half um half its hit points gone, which is really bad. So you can see down the bottom here, we've got the mini-map, okay. And um, yeah, more enemies just keep spawning. I'm going to keep spawning until we destroy them. Again, the population keeps going back up to 14. I wonder if um, it really likes a sort of surplus throw of 10. Okay, so we've got our first warrior. So, okay, I wonder if we can get some stats. Um, level 1, experience, um, charge hits, 13. So, these can only, little dudes can only take 3 hits when they die. These big dudes can take a lot more hits, and I think they do a lot more damage too. Strength 5, strength 0. And, you know, this is awesome. They shoot little parrots, which is really sweet. Come on guys, attack! Oh, thank goodness! So like I say, if our surplus flow falls below zero, then I'm in serious problem. Well, I've got serious problems, okay? I'm going to put the construction of that on high priority and be nice to attack for once, wouldn't it? Look at that nasty beast. Okay, so I've saved the game now. These guys have got a horrendous hit rate. I don't know why the hit rate is so appalling. It's when we hit this dude, right? See if we can take this area back. Maybe we can um, build another tone spreader here. I put this as a high medium priority. Bear in mind on easier difficulties, this isn't nearly as bad, but...
Okay, we're building a second dojo here, okay? But bear in mind our um, flow of um, tone is getting really low. So we really need to destroy this ASAP. Oh jeez, that's not good. So you notice it says the Leviathan has broken the third bond. I don't exactly know 100% what that means, but so what I'm going to do is so I'm going to put all my creatures on um, red alert, okay? And hopefully they'll, um, we can destroy this horrible spawning enemy thing. Come on, guys, we've got to destroy this thing. Okay, so I'm down to eight workers, right? Which is really low. And bear in mind, the workers won't actually um, attack any kind of buildings, so it's all down to these dudes to actually do that. Okay, so we've got nine workers here. So I don't think this pool's got any, um... Oh. Okay. Want it destroyed? Oh my goodness. Again, I've still got eight workers, so that's not too bad. Oh my goodness me. We're gonna celebrate tonight, I think. Yeah, we've still got nine workers. They keep respawning, which is pretty lucky because otherwise I'd be pretty doomed. How many crystals are actually stored here? Not very many. Okay, bear in mind, um, I've now got a key, okay? I can click on um, this artifact button here. I've got a key which will um, allow this object to um, uh, create a bridge to another um, area of the game and uh, that bridge is pretty cool so it means I can go to another island but I don't want to take this island first see I don't actually know how the coding works on this game okay I don't know if it starts the sort of simulation as it were when um, I actually put the bridge in place or whether everything is running simultaneously but I kind of suspect it um, waits until I've actually put the key in so I might not initially want to put the key in very quickly though I could be completely wrong about that I don't know Ooh, look we've got a second dojo awesome my little workers are putting all the crystals in Right, and we've now got four warriors instead of three. One from the second dojo, which is great. Awesome. So I'm going to send my little dudes down here to um, kind of guard this area. Awesome, so now I've got this um, 
area. Gonna have to build another tone split here, unfortunately. We've got nine tone, so I can invest in another um, dojo possibly. That'll be good. Awesome, so we're busy shoveling crystals into um, here, and maybe I need another crystal thing, but I'm thinking maybe if I have a crystal thing here, maybe I can have another dojo around here somewhere. Uh oh. Oh, I had to go to red alert there, right. Because honestly, if this pool gets infected, then um, it's very bad news. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, thank goodness. So I've got 14 workers, so it's pretty high. I'm gonna get these buildings repaired up. And as you can see, you can turn the building on or off. So, um, if you don't have enough... Oh! No, 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 no. Come on, guys. You're neglecting your duties. I have to put that on high priority. Ah, brilliant. So, here's a bit of strategy, guys. If I put the key in here, okay, then um, one of my little um, floaters is going to go over here. And he's going to bung the key in. And hopefully he won't die. Ooh! A new world. As you can see, guys, right? This is, um... That's kind of, um... Enabled me to have a better view pretty much what's going on, so... I think the hit rate always was meant to be pretty low for, me, for these guys.
Bear in mind, this two's out of energy now. But he can still kind of attack like the others anyway. Okay, so we've got 11 workers, right. Oh jeez, I've got two workers left. <laughs> That's awful. I mean, that should steadily increase. No, 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 guys. You're going to attack this spawning area. Hi. Cool. Guys, honestly, when this, um, this horrible thing, this Leviathan beastry is um, destroyed. Honestly, that's going to be so beneficial. Again, you might notice um, the um, workers have gone up to six, but bear in mind, some of the workers are going to become warriors. Oh my goodness me! Look, kill that spawn. Kill it. Quill it. No, no, if the spawn is fine. Okay, guys, good job. You can go have a rest now. Yeah, all floaters return to base. Okay, everyone's returned to base. Done a good job there. Now, fingers crossed, there aren't any more spawning pools. Or if there are, they're going to spawn at a much lower rate. But yeah, good job. This might become reinfected, so I'm not kind of resting too much yet, but... <sighs> okay, 13 population, 7 workers. And the enemy is attacking, okay. Kind of gone a red alert, but honestly, I want to um, focus on taking this area here. So, you know, destroying the enemy here is um, going to be really beneficial.
So, okay, these ranged units are pretty good against stationary targets. Awesome. Okay, I'm going to get another tone splitter here as quickly as possible. I'm going to cap these, I think. And uh, high priority that, I think. What's this world like? Ooh. So, okay, we've got three art four artifacts, five here. Okay, and we've, um, let me see, you've got some nasty looking dudes here. Look, oh, okay. The Den of the Beast trains its disciples to shift their form into the physical realm, giving them tough armor and increased strength, okay? So these are really the melee units, okay? So, uh, we'll definitely get some of them. I think we might have actually um, beaten this um, particular area, which is pretty sweet. going to get along to the end. Mystic location, okay. So, if you look at the objects, okay, um, I don't, maybe I could try putting that in there. If it doesn't work, um, the little, little floats will come back and tell me it doesn't work. My fingers crossed we can <coughs> sorry go to the end yeah okay I can go to the end now see if that fits in there I don't think it does if memory serves I think I need to put some kind of egg in that area of course you've got the um text down here which kind of gives you a clue about what's going on so okay I really want to get this second dojo um built which is a high priority. I wonder if I should even have a third, I don't know. It's on hard mode, so definitely gonna need another crystal. Don't have to worry too much because um obviously I've taken this area now, but it's still a race against time. And I'm also thinking maybe I should build a mystic, um... A mystic thing, um, which will kind of create, um... Kind of mystic tone, okay? They're, um, used for widget, wizards and ma mages and things. Okay, the enemy isn't really the sport... Isn't really the sport... I can't speak today. The enemy isn't really spawning much here, but... They probably will when I start attacking, so I don't really want to set them off too much until I need to. I guess I could attack these um these guys. No. But anyway, um, you guys get an idea of what the game's like, you know. It, sure, it takes a while to do um some things, and um, obviously if I prioritise, I can actually get this up quicker. So, it might be an idea. Um.
I want to check the status, okay. So this one's coming along very nicely. <clears throat> which is a dojo. Actually, I'm going to put all my um little pawns on that. Just get this thing built, huh? Awesome. Again, I'm wondering about shutting this thing down. Now, you can't shut them down, you actually need to destroy them, okay? But, um... I could probably shut this one down, I don't think I need this one. Okay, notice that um, I've lost access to some of these, which isn't really a problem. Um, but I've still got access to this, and my tone has gone up by one. You know, which is quite good. Sweet, the little spiky dudes are coming out now. Bear in mind, I'm probably going to need to go to um, another area to expand my zone. Is there any other deficiencies I can make here? I don't think there are. Yeah? Alright, up, up, down! Sorry, guys. Um, so, I'm going to go and get some uh, pizza. Tell you what, I don't really need this. Um, I might need it later on, I don't know, but I don't need it now, so um, I guess I could destroy this. Because um, I think later on, if I put the object in a mystic location, it's going to give me a whole load of tone, okay? But I can always just re get this area. Okay, awesome. Great, so all my uh, dudes have come here, and actually the little workers don't have much to do. Um, so I wonder if I should build a second, oh I've got that second dojo anyway, don't I? I've got two now. Okay, so... So, okay guys, I'm going to skip um, forward, but um, I'll um, leave it here for now, I guess. Um. So, hey guys, um, back again. So, I've always noticed one of the um, interesting things is when you load up a save, okay, this didn't happen on Windows 95. Um, your little dude up here always kind of goes a bit crazy, so um, that's what I'm pointing that out. Um, so, yeah, we, we pause for game and it's exactly the same position we were in before um so okay um we um basically we've got our dudes here okay um they're all here so um what are we gonna do okay 
we need a um we sort of need an uh, a, a, an attack okay so what i'm sort of thinking is i build a um okay so let's start <clears throat> gathering some of this um magic in here and then what that will enable us to do it will enable us to teleport buildings okay which will be very very useful um okay so here's some magic um that's sort of being gathered okay okay awesome Maybe I'm going to um, build another one of these magic crystal plants, okay? Now, I don't think there are any other requirements. Um, I don't think, anyway. For teleportation, but I could be wrong. Ah, see, okay, it seems like as soon as we had 10 magic, right, then we could teleport buildings, okay? So, what I'm thinking is, um, okay, maybe, that's interesting, maybe it takes different levels of um, magic to actually teleport different buildings, right? That will kind of make sense, I guess. So, these cost um, 10. Now, there's no reason why this should be down here, so I'm sort of thinking... Um, if I put this, where, where should I put it? Okay, so this is an important point, and this is an important point. So if I put this, for example, here, okay, perfect. That'll be a bit better. Now, I'm sort of thinking, um, I quite like to teleport these buildings up to here, but it doesn't really matter for now. Um, but ideally, um, I want from in the middle, okay? Or I'd even want from around here. Anyway, I'm just going to attack, okay? That's so what I'm going to do. I'm going to see if I can issue orders, okay, when the game is paused. And I'm going to see if they start coming, okay? Some. Um... Yeah, 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 seems like I can issue orders. You notice these guys are all in transit now. You can kind of see they um, kind of go a bit um, ethery, okay? So, yeah, maybe attack begin. Okay, that was pretty, pretty successful, I'd say. So, now bear in mind, okay, the um, enemy also becomes more powerful over time, so, okay, um, I'm going to start gathering these artifacts, okay? Just to get some more space on the screen. I'm going to want to construct one of these um, tone spreaders here, okay? Okay, so I'd say that was a pretty successful invasion, actually. Now, as you can see, these guys are going to go home. They're going to heal up. Oh geez, let's hope they miss. I think he's okay. Ooh, okay, good. Wanna kill that spawn, definitely. So 
So I want to kill this guy. I'm thinking um, some kind of ranged attack would be good. I'm also thinking higher priority for that. So bear in mind, um, there's a lot of crystal use right now um, on the home world, okay? Um, oh, that's not the home world, sorry. So yeah, um, these guys are going to be getting a lot of crystals right now. Um, so we could ideally do with a few more crystals, but bear in mind, we don't have very much, um, not very high surplus flow at the moment. So... Perfect. I'm sort of thinking, well, let's just put everyone on construction right now. Just gonna save the game, okay? Because, you know, this actually works incredibly reliably considering it's um quite an old game. But and I've also um patched this to the um, newest version, so um, it's a bit more reliable than it was. Um, so, okay, we can now um, teleport buildings if we if I wanted to. Might actually be a good idea. I don't actually know if I can teleport between worlds. It would be really interesting if I could. Might actually have a little go at that, see what happens. So, if, for example, I want to teleport this guy, um, can I teleport it here? <gasps> oh my goodness, I can! That's amazing! Again, I think I need a time spreader here. Nope, 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 definitely don't want that. Brilliant. So, okay, you can now teleport that house. Our main house, not that I necessarily want to, but... Come on, guys! Wait for my little workers to come and actually do this. I don't know why this isn't working, but I'm thinking of reissuing it, seeing I mean, a little look at that works. Again, this might not be advisable, but one of the things I've noticed is whenever, um, workers teleport they go to the nearest um bridge okay so if i put the um key in here right it might actually make it easier for um for our dudes to actually teleport over So what happens if I turn this off, okay? So now we've got a flow. Oh, okay, that's the problem. I need a surplus flow of at least one. Otherwise, everyone starts just messing around, okay? Now 
Now I should see some workers sort of great. So I really want to get some momentum going here, right? Because this game, well, really need that momentum, right? Okay, so I'm not going to click on that weld until I um, need to, right? Oh, it's going to feel so good to get rid of that horrible blaster. I tell you what, I don't actually need like all of those going, so I just shut these down, okay? Until I can get some more sort of flow. Oh look, fantastic. Right, fantastic. Let's get rid of these horrible... Horrible dudes, okay. See what I mean? The ranged units have a pretty high chance of missing, but, you know, they um, do take a lot less damage, right? Let's just take this one out. Okay, so we've got four flow, so I can probably safely put this back on. And I also want to gather up these artifacts. Brilliant. Got to keep up that momentum, okay? I know it sort of seems cool, but they will sort of they are sacrificing their lives for the good of the community, in a sense. Oh, poor little things. You destroy that nah. Okay, destroy that horrible thing, because
Again, speed is actually important in this game because I um, basically want to progress as quickly as possible. Because, like I say, the enemy gets more powerful over time, so... Come on, get back. That's it. Good beasties. Come on, guys, you gotta kill that evil fish. Come on. <sighs> Where are my soldiers? Come on, dudes. I know they're healing, but. No, 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 no. You attack that. Oh, dude, come on. Okay, great. Turn that on. Yeah, let's get back teleported over to Okay, brilliant. See what this teleporting thing really works well.
So, okay. Now, when our um, troops um, need to recharge, they don't have to go too far, do they, really? They just need to go here. And, okay, it costs sort of... Um, it kind of costs resources to teleport the buildings, but it's working all right so far. And, okay, this isn't a very difficult land, right? But, um... Still... It's working okay. It's probably overkill. <laughs> I'm also thinking I don't need any crystal. Um, actually, I do. I do need um some like. Awesome. So I probably just need one tone thing now. So again, I'll just teleport this over. Now that's it for um the stuff that we need, okay? Um sort of thinking this might be quite a nice base anyway. Um a sort of more of a permanent thing. Again, I wonder if I can get my um, attackers in to um, do a bit of damage to this structure here. for jobs queue um I just um, love this game, right? Because it's um, so immersive, right? It really is like another planet, right? Or another world or something. Oh, the flow is too low, right? Okay, well that would kind of make sense, I guess. So I guess I'll turn off this one. And the flow is higher. Oh, shoot, sorry. Again, I thought I saw this. I um, don't really know why I need this here. I might need it later on, so I'm gonna um, to get over here, right? So again, I'm just double checking. There's nothing here that is um, that I I don't need anything on this map, right? I don't even think I need this one actually. Because, um, you know, this pool should kind of be automatic because I've got my um, house here, so. Anyway. So that's almost constructed.
Ha ha ha! Right, I haven't seen any spawn for a while, so perhaps um, we've eliminated all the spawn. Anyway, let's obliterate these guys. Sending my um, warrior dudes too. I think they gain experience anyway, so we may gain, um, we may get a bit hurt, but uh, okay, cool. Okay, another time splitter here, I guess. And come to think of it, I don't really need a time splitter there, so uh, let's um, destroy that one. Okay, brilliant. Probably do need these two here because otherwise I'll lose access to some of these. But um, these two are completely superfluous actually. Again, this one's kind of a bit superfluous now, so we'll get rid of that. Great, and I've got loads of time coming in. Oh, that's interesting. This one's completely broken. But it doesn't really matter because the time pool's still kind of working, so... I don't quite know how that works. That's a question. Do I actually need these things after I've um after I've done expanding? But no idea actually. If I don't, I could save an absolute fortune in tone, which I could actually spend on something more productive. Because obviously every building takes one tone, every unit costs one tone, so um, more tone for the um, for the troops. Yeah, I guess we didn't need that. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I don't have another gateway key, but I do have another land unlocked, so that's okay. Yeah, just as I suspected, I can now build a third kind of building up here. Which will be, let me have a look, is it the magic building? Believe it. It didn't actually say so. But I don't think I want two of them.
gosh, I am so sorry, guys. That's the stupidest thing I've done for a while. I kind of deleted my um, Tone Spreader here. Might have had to have rebuilt it anyway, so. So I'll tell you what, whilst I'm thinking about it, right? If I don't actually need these Tone Spreaders to actually. harvest the tone here, which it sort of seems I don't. Um, like I say, I'll save a fortune, so do an experiment. I'll destroy this and see if I keep the tone. Hey, brilliant. So here comes my uh, my melee fighters to um, destroy the time spreader here. You can kind of see them um, just in the beam up here. Okay, perfect. So I'm keeping an eye on the tone. Okay. Yep. No, 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 no. You're not done yet. Can attack that thing too. <laughs> yeah, we're keeping the time to time flowing. Cool. <laughs> Okay, so that's pretty much everything explored. I could probably actually explore a little bit more, but I'm actually not too fast. Let's take out these then. Seeing as there's no enemy threat anymore. No, 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 dudes. My dudes, come on. Okay, they're doing a very good job. But I do need these two because basically they're um, sort of keeping these buildings working. But I don't need this one, interest, or do I? Hmm. I guess I'll keep it for now anyway. any other efficiencies I can really make. Uh, this one might... We might be able to do without that one, I don't know. If I lose the game now, I'm going to look silly, but I won't. Okay, brilliant. 100% efficiency, guys. Put all that extra tone into, um... Into the army. Ooh, look at that. A new area to explore. So, okay, I really need five um, large pools. So I'm thinking one, two, three, four, one, two, four. yeah. I think, okay, as long as they're near one of these bridges, right, they'll, um, they'll basically um, come back um, to here, right? It takes the same amount of time to teleport to any um, different area, basically. Um, so if the bridge takes 20 seconds, it takes 20 seconds to get to anywhere on the, in the universe, basically. 
via a bridge. So I could move all my buildings down here. Um, I'm wondering if I, if I should just move them to different planets or not. No. Anyway, this is the um, next area to be invaded, I guess. I'll tell you what, I'll move them all down here, and if I change my mind, that'll be fine. Oop. Um. So that can go there. Go there. Can go there. I can go there. And lastly, but not leastly, this one. <laughs> I can go. Barely worth moving it, actually. Oh, I suppose I'll move it. <coughs> So again, I'm going to put the magic one here. I'm going to put crystal one here. Another crystal doodad uh, here. Another crystal doodad. Yeah, brilliant. And it's another crystal doodad thingy. Well, I wouldn't think so. Okay, so I've actually used up all my magic. That's okay. What I'm also thinking is, um, well, just why I am thinking about it. You guys can destroy this one and. You guys can destroy this one. And this will keep working because it's near the tone pool. This one, I. I don't think the tone pool will really extend up there anyway. I do like the graphics in this game, they're kind of like really simple and it's kind of old fashioned but nice, you know? No. Anyway, let's get all our units out here. Okay. So this is a magic dude, I believe. Awesome. Um, so I guess we can. Pause the game and get everyone over here. And you can come and float around here. Great! This should be orders, right? The enchantment druids. Heal Dojo. I forgot healing. Um. Area healing. Repair a building. Pull down a celestial boulder but destroy any spawn of the Leviathan. That's good. Awaken spirit level 2. No, 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 come over here, dude. <sighs> okay, now I'm thinking I should teleport this to, uh... Yeah.
Now look. This is level two, okay? But this would be a seriously awesome spell to have if I could just um demolish one of these dudes with this level two spell. That'd be kind of amazing. So that destroys um, an enemy unit by the looks of things. Uh. How much of the same way to attack? Does he do anything? I think he's just going to attack like a normal kind of normal unit, I guess. Which is actually useful in itself. Come on dudes, I don't care if you don't have energy, you've got to attack. Get him. Oh look, another magic area. Do what you guys can do for me. You can destroy that. This kind of reminds me of um, little dogs or something. No, they're kind of cute and conquer creatures. <laughs> no, 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 not yet. Sorry. Need to build this one first to activate the pool. You go and go attack that dude, come on. I wanna attack it. No, 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 no. First things first, I really wanna destroy this um stupid pool. Goodness. These fighting dojos are um really useful to have around. But these guys, um, they're kind of better at range anyway, so So we're gonna need to teleport across to crystals, I think. Right, let's teleport that one across to here.
Uh, crystal, crystal, and where does he have a crystal bomb? There was some of my original land. Or a crystal thing anywhere. If not, I have to build one. That doesn't seem to be. Oh my gosh, where am I going? So I think my um, building tone builder construction thing has um, been destroyed, so I forget what it is. Okay, that's a diamond, so we could really do with another just normal building wall. So again, I've got two artifact things up here. Um, what do I say? The halls of stories. The hall of stories and the earliest memories. Floaters. Two keys to the need to open the secrets of the hall. New ones and the floaters each kept a key. Key of the East, maybe. Sounds about right. Thank <laughs> you. 
double checking, there really isn't any kind of. I don't believe there's only one construction or producer in the whole thing. I'm just going to move that to my uh, new island because this is honestly taking forever. But I'll tell you what else I'm going to do. I'm going to issue another one um, to be built here. So. I can get the things muddled up. <laughs> oh my goodness me, look. That's speeded up production about a million times. Oh, okay, brilliant. Experience 5 of 75. Sort of thinking if I keep leveling him up, right? Um, So, as you can kind of imagine, this is a real sort of completionist game, you know. Hey, come away, guys. Come on. Like, well, you know, this, um, because I've put it on the biggest um, size, right, there's huge numbers of, um, you know, different um, areas to explore, you know. And I tell you what, you know, you can really get some amazing kind of efficiency when um, you um, destroy, you know, the appropriate time spreaders after you've um, conquered the land. Gosh, these take a lot, don't they? Ooh, brilliant, more diamonds. So now all the dojos have um, diamonds each. So you guys can destroy that one. Yeah, let's just save the game, you know? Like I say, this game was um, built for Windows 95, but it's working beautifully on Windows 10, you know? I guess that's just good um, compatibility, but, you know, sort of fundamentally good design, really, you know? Didn't do anything too odd, you know? Just works, you know? This really annoys me. Ok, 
Okay, for example, this guy's 1717. He's 17 um Again, I'll call this dude here, right? Why can't he do the healing? Come on guys, we've got to take this out, you know. Brilliant. So you want to stick another key in there. Anyway, I really want to level this guy up, right? Because some of the level 2 stuff would be so useful. Again, I'm going to try casting that here. Brilliant! Look at this. Look at this XP. Just rocketed up. Oh 
yeah. Going up nicely. Oh wow, look, our main building's actually upgraded. Very nice. It's taking too long. Oh wow, we can upgrade this dojo. Great base. Right. He doesn't have enough resources to do that. Just need 20 more XP, come on guys. Uh huh, brilliant. Just need uh, 10 more experience to get to level 2. We unlock these awesome things. Like free tone pool, that's amazing. Tell you what, I'm going to go back to um, planet where the magic is, right? Okay, and I'm thinking I'm going to build another um, sort of crystal thing. Okay.
because this is um, eating up all the crystals, honestly. Five of seventy five. Eighty of seventy five, huh? I don't know quite how that works, but uh, hmm. I mean, perhaps the upgrades actually come with um, more territory, basically. That can be the uh, can be how it works. One question is, what actually does experience do? Again, I really need to expand my army. I mean, 70% of my population are um, workers, and I really don't need that many workers, so... <sighs> oh, this is a bit unfair. Maybe these guys can soak up some other damage. I suspect it will fire on the building, maybe. Hmm.
Okay, so we've unlocked this um, whole level. Um, I'm actually thinking of um, moving some stuff back to um, here, maybe. Just to keep it simple. I mean, look, this is fine, I guess. This is nothing on this level whatsoever. thinking maybe the um, floaters won't have to go so far anymore because you know there's the bridge here okay great I think what I want to do I want to move my um, my um, magic um, things are here too okay you kind of see, you know, why I'm amalgamating it. Oh my goodness me, that looks like a horrendous place. Oh, right, EO. Okay, let's um, get this back to the mainland. Might as well move them all back to the mainland, actually. Sorry. Don't need that anymore. I'll move these back to Pamelan too. Oh, sorry. Oh gosh. Kinda of confusing, but <sighs> we're gonna stick this big old thing. Great, so I'll completely mess that up. One crystal. Um. So there's nothing left on here, right? So I can um send my armies to do some dirty work over here. Actually, they're fine where they are, but okay, so these only need crystals, and they have crystals. Okay, that's great. But these um, guys don't need this one. This one. Don't need this one. 
for this one. Come to think of it, I don't actually need this one either. Right, that's still going. Okay, perfect. <clears throat> Just move this up here. Great. How's that for super efficiency? Okay, so we've got three super efficient areas. That's super efficient. <laughs> it's pretty super efficient, but I think I could do another sort of crystal thing here. Yeah, we've got a crystal thing each. Um. Oh my goodness me, look at this. So, again, 67% of my pops are workers. So I'm thinking maybe if I keep a 50-50 balance, that might be good. So... Can't upgrade these yet. If I go back to oh no 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 not that one. This one. Yeah, if I come back here... I'm sort of thinking there's a large pool up here. We can have some more ranged units, I think. I have another crystal dispenser. I can cancel that and put it um, here. A little bit closer. <sighs> so, oh my god. I know I've already said that, but oh geez. Um That looks like a very well um, sort of established area. Very well established, so. Hmm. I've only got 5 surplus flow, but 67% workers, so. That's okay. Let's go watch this being built.
I could teleport, but there's only large things around here anyway. I could just teleport anyway. <gasps> Wait, I've just spotted something. More efficiency. Right. Let's teleport these up here. My crystal here, and this crystal here. Now go uh, here, and then I can destroy that thing. to say it it might actually be um <laughs> better off if it was here there are the um crystals Anyway, let's attack this new land, right? We'll have our um we'll have more troops coming anyway. So again I'm gonna pause it and you guys can go and attack here. You guys can also attack there. You guys can uh attack here. You guys go and kill those yeah, horrible stuff. And you and attack this big beastie here. <sighs> oh Christ. Jesus crumbs. I wish this dude was level 2. Look, he's got 90 experience for 75. What does that even mean?
Right. Actually, tell you what, you guys can attack that thing. Awesome. <laughs> this little doozy, anyone standing here to protect us? I'm still trying to level up. thinking um that was a mess island I'm thinking here I built another dojo didn't I that's, that's it oh brilliant got about that so okay
So I figured out what this does. Um, when I click that button, basically it sends the little dude home, and he um, he'll basically heal the most wounded um, floaters, basically. So this, I think he um, you can target an individual dojo. Uh, structure destroys any enemy. Very, very powerful. I think when we get to the end of this guys I'm just going to upload this as part 1 because honestly the video is getting crazy long so one thing you can do but I don't really want to do is if you put the um, your units on red alert it oh gosh kind of stops them running off be nice if um, in this game we had the option of a melee attack, you know, but didn't actually cost any um, mana. Yeah, when I've taken this land, guys, I'm just going to quit for a bit and upload this and come back to it another time. I don't even know if anyone will watch this, but it's um, quite a good old game and it's quite relaxing, I guess. Mind you, on your hand, this is a long video. You know, people like to be entertained, don't they, I guess. But Heck, I'm just going to upload it anyway, because... I mean, I'm trying to play as fast as I can, honestly. Like, um, it's not exactly the easiest game to do a speed run on. <laughs> Although one thing you can do, to be honest, is if you, um, for example, connect both ends of the map, right, with um, two different bridges, right, it kind of means that you unlock the whole, um, you can see everything, which actually makes it a lot easier. But like I say, um, I've kind of also got this theory that um, if you unlock other areas, then um, they start growing. And that's not what I really want. So much experience, it's crazy.
way my aim hits the magician. Yeah, my magician's got insane amounts of experience. Oh my god. God, that packs a punch. This game is just summoning upon summoning upon summoning. All I ever do is just...
Okay, so we're pretty much taking my whole land. Need to um build another time spreader here. So you go off and heal everyone. Tell you what, um, seeing as how I've pretty much completed this um, little area, maybe I should um, start disposing of some of these buildings. Ha ha ha! Right, we are at the end. Wonderful. And I will teleport you here. Why not? Look, they're just loading this up with um crystals. I mean oh, I suppose there's enough crystals around here. Okay, so great, we've um done a lot of islands now. Um We've got seven tone, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's nothing here. I don't know what to do. Should I try another one or should I just go to uh, do something else, come back later? Hmm. Oh, this is a pretty darn long video anyway, so. I'm so should I come back later. Where should I go next, guys? Look, you know, I said how if there's two bridges, right, we could see the whole, like, area here. I wonder if I should try that, right, because I've got loads of keys. I'll stick one in there. Okay. Then I'll... Now oh, where? Here's another one. Stick one in here. We'll just see what happens. I think I've, um, yeah, there's only two bridges on the map here, and I've got them both, so. Mm. Okay, so I've got seven. Seven flow, that's pretty good.
let's see where this one goes. <gasps> it goes over there. This one goes there, okay. There must be another one here. It's a bridge here, you see. And the bridge here. Oh no, and a bridge there too. Honestly, I don't know if they're even... But I kind of figure this probably isn't going to do anything until I attack anyway. That's my new thinking on the issue. Bung them all in, shall we? <gasps> yes! OMG, man. OMG, uh, really. Super OMG. Look at that. Oh. We just see one long and big invasion. That's amazing. On our peak. And kind of hurts. Let's go have a look at my home. That's not my home. Move back to there. That's closer. So look, I'm thinking, right, this game is active. It looks active, doesn't it? I wonder if I should just take this land very quickly. I want to know what the range is on my mage. If it's infinite range, infinite range, do some serious harm to these two so along here. Hmm. Uh-oh, what have I done? Shit. Again, I'm going to pause the game. Oh my goodness me. Unpause the game. I can upgrade all my little um. Wow, I can upgrade all my dojos. <gasps> I can upgrade to level 2! My goodness. Wow, I can upgrade everything. Okay, guys, so I've just figured something out. Um. Your level is actually dependent on how many bridges you have, okay? So now that I've got millions of bridges everywhere, I can upgrade to a really high level. That's interesting, huh? What do I actually need to upgrade? I've got no idea. Oh, they need building material. Oh, jeez, and I don't really have much of that at all. circumstances I think. I'll let them take the um building materials from my home. <laughs> I 
is the point, actually? Where was I a second ago? I was almost saw a volcanic island, wasn't I? Whatever happened to my, uh, building stuff? I don't know. It's a really cool area. Not spawning actually. Be back in five minutes, guys. Actually, that's that. Hey guys, so nothing spawned. But a floater has advanced, apparently. See, our dude's got a funny hat. That's awesome. Invigorate the floaters of a dojo with life energy so they can better withstand attacks. So defense boost. Shift the floater of a dojo into the next realm of existence. Hmm. That's one I'm really interested in. Let's try this. So. Okay, right clicking on this will make it vanish. It's not actually what we want. <laughs> oh no, where's it gone? <laughs> Alright! 
Right, let's have a little go here then, shall we? Pause the game. You guys can attack. Uh, you guys can attack that horrendous beast. You guys can attack this one. You guys can yeah, just get them. You guys save that and you guys can attack here. Okay. Everyone's in transit. Some people are gonna die today. Unfortunately. Oh no. for range on this thing. Oh my goodness me, that's awesome. This is like the best ability in the world. God, these dudes are freaking amazing. I'm using this, um, the major special abilities, obviously. They are spectacular.
to send out the magic bird. <sighs> the bird of awesomeness. Why do they keep spawning down Just attack that, okay? Just kill it. Seriously, this is really fucking me. Same even go. This will actually work on these teams. Oh my gosh, it does. Oh, I see. It doesn't actually work. So unfortunately I've got to activate all um gotta activate all the 
tone pools around here, so that's fine. So now what I want to do is look if this will work. Oh look. I think it does work, but you need to click on the dojo itself. Okay, so I guess what happens is um, that magic spell makes some um, the dojos, well, the float the warriors more elite, I guess. We'll have to see when we come. <laughs> the big one, but no idea what that did. Doesn't look like the other do the other areas are really um getting off. Which is good. We've also got two more keys, so I wonder if there's any more areas we can unlock. Possibly this area. We put key in here. So I'd have to liberate it first. But see there's another island here, so. I could try putting a key in here. And another. No. Oh. <gasps> there it is! Great. And another one in here. Hopefully this should unlock nearly all of this. Mm. Oh, there we go. Just a lock then. Oh, I've lost track. Oh, walk. Oh, it's this one. Wow. 
Oh. Okay, so we've got this one and this one. Wonderful. It's the last time I launched that at the um, dojo itself and it didn't do anything. This time I'm going to try launching it at the worker. Seeing if that does anything. So it officially does nothing, it seems. <laughs> well, should we attack next? This one will be good. I don't know, maybe this one? <gasps> you know what? I'm just going to save it for now. Thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed it.